now I'll try to record uh, some geometry dash footage with uh, not OBS this time, but with Nvidia Shadow Play. So I know that shifting delay over time is a common issue for uh, the Nvidia Shadow Play, but there are people who say that uh, clicks going all over the place, like first click is uh, has uh, zero milliseconds delay, the second click has thirty milliseconds delay, I, and I think that it's not normal. But some people say that it's NVIDIA Shadow Plays issue, so I want to record this to check if it is uh, really as it's uh, said or not. So I'll play some of the levels, I'll make sure to play more than 5 minutes. Also I'll make sure to play um, levels where it's easy to spot if there is movement or not, like levels with a lot of waves or something. Also I'll do a s slower level with the waves, so I can see more clearly uh, that wave moves and uh, after it I'll I'll compare clicks with movements and I'll and we'll see if clicks are uh, being all over, all over the place or not so let's go I'll make sure to click as hard as possible to make them audible for sure so let's go And also, I made sure that it records in highest possible possible quality, so there is no such an issue as low quality recording or something like that. I have an RTX 2070 uh, Super card, so it's not a problem for me. That's done. Okay, that's enough for this layout. Also, I have another layout which uh, has as little buffer clicks as shut up, as little buffer clicks as possible. So we'll play this one. Yes. And this is slower, which is a plus. The movements are not as intense, so it will be more accurate when we check it, it will be more accurate. What's the deal with all that freezes? Why don't they just, just freeze on me? Okay, sweet. Also, I remember Delta interface had some really good wave parts to check. So let's play them. Okay, this wave part is really really fast, so it's not that good because it, it's less accurate. Uh, there is a wave part earlier that is really really good in that regard because it's it's just the slowest wave possible and it's a big wave which is also a plus actually it moves away really quickly uh, i have to put start position in the other play in another place okay Okay, I really suck at this ship, so I died immediately. Oh well, uh, the main thing is that I've checked the wave many times, so I can't end this. I can end this recording because I think it it have been more than five minutes, a lot more. So let's check.
And also, I think I have to prove that it's really a uh, GeForce Shadow Play footage and nothing else. Firstly, GeForce. I have GeForce experience. Consequently, I'll have an overlay for every game I have. Also, there is an RTX 2070 Super video card uh, in my computer. And yeah, it looks like I'm show off in, uh, sh showing off with my <laughs> specs. Okay. And also, let's see the video itself. So, this is the name that G GeForce, uh, that Nvidia Shadow Play gives to its recorded videos. I've seen only Shadow Play gives uh, this kind of names with game and everything. Uh, for example, OBS doesn't show in the uh, name which game was it because it just records the screen. Uh, and uh, properties and there is this in GeForce Share. Uh, I hope. Oh lol, I can edit this, <laughs> I didn't know. Okay, uh, I hope that uh, this is a really uh, a proof that it's been recorded by NVIDIA Shadowplay. If I'm wrong on that, fi uh, fix me please in the comments. I hope I'll get any comments, but oh well. So let's open Premiere Pro. Okay, untitled this. Okay. Let's delete this crap and put another crap here. So there is mm, okay, and we have different audio audio tracks for the internal audio and for uh, the microphone. So I'll play some. Okay, that's good. So I can mute internal audio so we can hear only clicks and there is the click so I line up with the wave movement so that's the frame where is the click itself so this click is for this red orb and this click is for this wave so I Delete the connection between the tracks. Uh, this this mouse sucks. It's so hard to scroll. Okay, there's the frame with the movement, and I make the thing that syncs the click. Like it's around this uh, frame, so it's good enough. In this frame, there is mo there is no movement, but there is movement in this frame. So I put click here. Also, let's find another movement. There is the movement. Mm. It's in the same frame. So, by this click and this click, I have the reference what it is, what's the difference should be at max. So it has to be inside of this frame. No movement, there is the movement. Why why is this so hard to scroll? Oh my god. Next click. So there is the movement. Around this frame. Okay, it's it's okay, I guess. There is no wave. So it's hard to see the movement. Okay, we, there is the spider. We can see a movement here. Spider teleports to this frame, and the click is exactly in the same frame. Um, yes, the same, the click and the movement. Again, the movement is there, and the click is right under, is right at the middle of this frame. Good enough. So there were the uh, other movements. So I don't know. There is a buffer click on the spider, but on the ship there is a real movement. Maybe here, but I'm not sure. Yeah, click is here, so the movement should be here. There is no movement. And there is, you can see this halo around the orb, so the movement starts here, the click. And uh, do you notice something? When I go to the frame with the movement, there is like this sound. No sound, no movement, no movement, no sound. 
No movement, no sound. There is... Like... There is the movement and there is this slight sound. Of the beginning of the click. So there is the click, the movement. And, and the click is right here. So it's, it's all good now. And I died here. Um, where's the another, where's another so, I, so there's me talking. So, and I'm talking again about my PC specs. So I have 2070 super, I'm so cool, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Again, the wave. Movements there. Clicks also there. And as you can see, in this frame, movement is pretty huge. So we can say that movement started somewhere near, near this point so the click is right here so it's really really uh, okay it's impossible without the good scrolling uh, it's it makes me mad this mouse is so good except for this scroll issue micro switches are really good in there but everything else is just ah uh, there's the movement where is the movement somewhere in these two frames i'm not sure because the wave goes down a little bit so it's hard to check and I died again. Okay, there is some good attempt. And... No movement, there is the movement, and there is the click. It's all perfect. So I think... I think it's okay. Let's pass over to another level. I love music on that level, by the way. It's atmospheric. Oh, there is the wave. Big wave. No movement. And click is there, and and movement is there. It's good enough, still. Where the movement begins, the click begins too. Uh, what's uh, at this? What is with this point? It's also okay. I can't see anything wrong with it. It's not like the. Uh, it's not like this click has uh, zero millisecond delay. <laughs> And other click has like 30 millisecond delay. That's not the case. All the clicks have the same delay. And it's dumb to say that GeForce Experience messes up the click because it doesn't. Oh, Delta interface. Perfect. But there is no click issue. All the clicks have the same delay. So it's impossible to have different delay on every click. All the clicks are perfect. No movement, no click. See? There's the click. Movement, there is the click. Also, let's go to the section with the slow wave. Because with the slow wave it's easier to see what's happening, because it's not as intense. Yes, I, th there I put the start position. Uh, yeah, Premiere Pro is really bad at showing, at showing waveforms, because these are so low. Maybe I sh should do like this. Okay. I think it's it's the, there's the click. So movements here, clicks here. Zoom in. Movements here, clicks here. There is no problem with shadow play. It's perfectly, perfectly good recording software. It doesn't mess up the audio. Clicks here and movements here. Uh, it's impossible to have different delays on clicks. It's just impossible. How people do this? Yes, people don't do this. If there is such thing in the footage, then it means that the footage is hacked. And I don't think of anything different that could have happened, that could have caused this issue with Oda. Only faked clicks do that. So. Uh, it's it's perfect. There's no problem with it. So let's jump to the conclusions. Nvidia Shadowplay doesn't affect the audio in the slightest and it doesn't mess it up. And we're not talking about the delay that grows over time, which haven't been seen there actually, but we're talking about the delay of the individual clicks. And as you can see, every click has the same delay within that 16.7 millisecond corridor. 16.7 is the biggest difference you can get between the delays of different clicks because 16.7 is the time of one frame in 60 fps video. And if you see 60 fps footage which has difference more than 16.7 milliseconds, I'll call it suspicious uh, because 
Probably these clicks are faked.